Today, we're gonna talk about Snapper. It's August, it's the full moon, and what does that mean down here in the Florida Keys especially? It's the mangrove snapper spawn. Anglers, both resident and visiting anglers, look forward to this time of the year all year long. The fishing explodes at the July full moon and the August full moon. Two peak periods when all of these mangroves, countless numbers of fish, they migrate down here to these outer reef edges to do their duty, right? And I'll tell you, the fishing can be fire. But it's all about the details, like with all other fisheries. While you can catch mangrove snapper around the state, certainly here, it's a very special event this time of the year. And I wanna talk you through, step by step, in detail, how to cash in on this hot bite. For starters, timing, we know, like I said, even though you can catch mangroves year round, that July full moon, couple days before, couple days after, and the August full moon, same thing, couple days before, couple days after, is when the fishing peaks. Time of the day, look, if you can get out here at night and fish these patch reefs at night, it's almost a sure thing. The mangrove snappers are nocturnal, they bite pretty much all night long, and that's gonna be a peak period. However, you could also catch them during the day, especially early in the morning. That's the key, is to get out there early in the morning, especially if you're looking for a better grade of fish. While there are countless fish that are keepers in the 12 to 16 inch range, that's not what we're looking for. We're looking for the next grade up. Really that 16 to 24 inch size. That's really what we're after. Look, you know as well as I do, there's places way out in the Gulf of Mexico, up off the East Coast, way offshore, where you can catch some really giant macros. Super slobs, five to 10 pounds, some even larger. It's rare that you're gonna find a mangrove snapper over five or six pounds on the patch reefs here in the Keys. Certainly every now and then, but it's rare. So that's really not what we're looking for. It's more of those three to five pound fish. Really healthy, strong fighters, and I'll tell you what, perhaps the best tasting snapper on the dinner table of all snappers, arguably, that's for sure.